Hi, my name is Mike Quinn, and this is the Ultimate Frontline Leadership Training Podcast. Today, we're going to be talking about the brand new year and how to set yourself up for more money. Now, if you work in the frontline industries right now, I'm about to tell you about an amazing opportunity that's available to you. Right now, the retail and restaurant, just the frontline industries in general, have a lack of leadership like crazy. There are very few credible leaders that I've seen in the last 20 years. Uh, there are a few good ones out there, and mostly there are just people who are winging it. And let me tell you something. If you want to be a concert pianist, you cannot just teach yourself how to play the piano, all right? You need a mentor. You need somebody who's done it before and who knows the ins and outs of things. I can help you do this stuff. I've lived it. I've lived 35 years in the front end industries as a manager, and I spent the last five years as an employee just to see what the heck is going on. And I know exactly now what you guys are going through. You guys have a total lack of leadership. Leadership doesn't care about the employees. They, everybody cares about just covering their own butts, pointing fingers, playing the blame game, and nobody is having a great time in the frontline industries right now. That can change. All we need is you. All we have to do to change this is for you to take a look at the person on your left and the person on your right. Make sure that if there's any problems, you're there to support them, etc. And that's really or most of what a leader does. So I know what you're going through. It's not fun. It's usually horrible jobs. People wake up dreading to go to work. You go to work and you just hope you're not going to get blamed for something. Uh, it just, you know... You just want to make it through your shift alive so you can get on home. It's just not a fun situation. When I came came up, the frontline industries were a great place for somebody without any major skills, like, you know, a doctor, lawyer, etc., who could earn an income. You can come on in. You can walk right on into a company. You can get hired on an entry-level position, and you can make money. What I'm here to tell you now is now that we know this because you've done it, you've got on in, you've got employed, and now you're working in a front end industry. Now you're looking around and you're seeing all these really crummy managers and nobody seems to care. And uh, it just it's not a great situation out there. You can change that. All it takes is one person to look out after the person on their left and the person on their right and for the three of you to work together and help each other out. And that's all it takes to start the change. All right. So all you need to do, if this is your brand new 2024 and you had a, a New Year's resolution, you want to make more money this year. Great. Start your own team. Grab somebody to the left of you. Grab somebody to the right of you and say, hey, look, man, I'll, I'll help you and you guys help me. And together we'll look after each other so that nobody gets blamed for everything and, and everything gets done on time and correctly. All right. So you're going to be your own little group, just three people, two people. If you find one other person, that's all, it, all you need. If there's nobody else that wants to help you, you are all you need. All you have to do is start treating everybody else with respect and dignity. And all of a sudden, people's attitudes are going to change towards you. When they change towards you, now you can help them change towards everybody else as well. So things can change with just one person just you. Uh, and if you can find a person or two to join you and to, to create this little band of people who want to change their lives, you don't want to work in an environment where you don't feel like you have any say, you have any rights, you have any anything. You just feel like you show up, you get told what to do all the time, you're blamed for stuff, and then you go home. <clears throat> and that's what the front lines industry are like right now. All it takes is one person with a can-do attitude, I'm going to change my life this year. And this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to look after people. I'm going to help people. I'm going to notice that, hey, something's about to go wrong here. I'm going to swoop on in and help them. Nobody has to ask me. I'm there to help. And then other people are going to want to do it too. And they're going to want to reciprocate with you when you help bail somebody else out. And now you've got a little team going. Positive environment at work is crucial. If you don't have a happy, positive environment at work, what do you have? You know, a paycheck. That's it. So if you want to have a happy and positive environment at work, it's up to you. You got to bring that to the party. All right. Your bosses aren't doing it. You think they're going to wake up one day and just go, oh, I'm going to be a great manager today and then start studying management and then, you know, start treating you better. It's not happening. So you got to do it. 
you got to step up and say, I'm going to treat my fellow worker better than my bosses are treating me. And then eventually people are going to like you and they're going to say, hey, that person should be a leader. You know, that person should be a manager. And you watch that one change alone is going to get people starting to talk positive things about you. And now we're off to the races. So if you want to have a positive and financially impacting year in 2024, then pick somebody on your left, pick somebody, pick a couple of people and make an agreement with them. Sit down at the lunchroom or whatever and say, hey, look, man, this really kind of sucks around here. Nobody seems to care about anything. I tell you what, let's just start a group, you and me or us three or us four or whatever. And let's look after each other. Let's cheer each other on. Let's uh, applaud each other's efforts and let's magnify them. Hey, if Fred does something really great and 10 other people say, hey, Fred did something great, the manager is going to hear it, right? Fred did something great. So if you guys magnify each other's performance and the, the great things that they do, man, you talk about a positive environment in day one. So just try it, all right? Just try it for 30 days. Go on in and try to be the most positive, helpful person you could possibly be and see what changes happen in your world. Now, I look forward to talking to you guys more. I got a lot more of this stuff to go for you. So, hey, I hope you have a great 2024, and I hope you do make a whole lot more money this year.